Hi, my name is Kimia Sun Francis. I am part of K-Swiss. I am Global Product and Trend Manager. And today we're at the WeWork building because as you know, our muse is the young entrepreneur. Right now we're working on an entire um, new model or a new shoe design for entrepreneurs, so we thought instead of sitting around in our offices and asking each other questions, we should go out and see who the real actual entrepreneurs are out there that are working, that are living, playing, traveling, and what they need exactly. So, so we're going to do an open discussion, just super casual, fun, and then we'll break out into groups so you'll see what the feedback is. Uh, my name's Sean. I uh, work for Bases Worldwide. Uh, my name is Shona, and uh, we are a general contracting company. I'm Sadi Ali Raja, creative director at uh, Nightfire Media. Collaborations is kind of like one of my big things because they're exclusive, rare, and I can always resell them after I've worn them for more than what I bought them for. My second bedroom is full of clothes and shoes. I have literally four racks of shoes, so I have 250 pairs of shoes, 220 actually. So I have a lot. I have a lot of sneakers, a lot of everything. Talk to me. On a day to day, it's hybrid. Um, I do a lot of walking on days where I know I'm going to sit. So you know, footwear in terms of comfort, that's a, that's, a, that's a key. Yeah, it was actually a pair on the table that I really liked. It was the leather with the light brown back with the white uh, bottom on them. So those are real comfortable, uh, something I could wear every day. Um, my big thing with tennis shoes is that I want to be able to wear them and beat them <laughs> until they're unwearable, because uh, I'm always on the go, so. Hitting most things decently, not everything well, not check every single box, but hitting most things decently so that it's versatile enough in its look that it can you know be casual and it can be semi-dressy. Uh, if I wear a pair when I know I'm gonna be somewhere like Fridays like I know I'm probably gonna go out for a drink or something I don't want to wear one of the shoes that I'm like beating the hell every day so. If I can give some advice it would be to define your target consumer and then take the time to go out and meet them and find out what makes them tick and what their needs are and then take that information to inform your product decisions instead of making it a guess and, and going off your own personal taste. The key is to do more listening than talking. The example I used is I'm a motorcycle guy and in the motorcycle business you know there's all types of different helmets you know but at least in terms of sport bikes you know there's one particular helmet that corners the market. Like uh, on one end, it's not the perfect race helmet. You know, it's not like the super comfortable touring, you know, helmet that you're gonna flip up the front, you know, and have a bunch of airflow. But driving around the street, going to a racetrack, going to the canyons, you know, it'll handle all of those. So I think a shoe that would do that kind of thing, because I've seen that work in another model, like to me, that's, that's the way to go. If, like if you're going there, that's the way to go. Hi everyone, we're back at the K-Swiss office. We received so much great insight and feedback from entrepreneurs like yourself over at our WeWork session, but we really want to hear your comments and your thoughts. So if you can use this video as inspiration to leave us feedback and, and just leave us a comment of what you want to see in a shoe for your lifestyle, just to fit all of your entrepreneur needs. Like if you're traveling, if you're going out, if you're just networking, what do you want to see on your feet to go with your outfit? Let us know. Leave us that comment. We'll pass it on to the design team and you'd be surprised. Maybe we'll actually use one of your ideas.